Welcome back to an episode of Baby W2. So, uh, it's lower quality and whatnot right now. It's because I'm just filming on my phone real quick for this intro. Uh, because you guys know from my original one wheel pint, uh, this, the video is like half an hour long. This one doesn't need to be as long. But, uh, yeah, if you guys saw my video, which I think a lot of you did, because it was my most popular video in like a long time, has almost a thousand views. Uh, I talked about the one wheel pint X and the GT. And I said I wasn't going to get one because I was fine with my pint. Uh, but I, I ended up getting a pint to X, so, yeah, dropped another, it was almost $1,700 on it, um, but, uh, yeah, I just got done riding it for a little bit, it's getting colder around here, um, it's not snowing quite yet, but it's definitely, it's, it's below, like, 40s, and so, um, but, yeah, I went on a 7 mile ride already, and it's, it just made it, like, 10 times more fun, like, it's only 2 miles an hour faster, um, has about 10 more ri mile range, um, but, uh, yeah, um, but yeah, it's just so fun, like, that two miles an hour, you might, you, I will include clips in this video, you guys, might, you guys might not think it's that fast, but when you're actually on the one wheel, like, I just wish all of you guys, if you haven't been on a one wheel, I just really wish all of you guys could experience it, it's so, I mean, it's so relaxing and fun and whatnot, but it's also just, like, you, you realize how fast you're actually going when you're on the one wheel, <laughs> it doesn't look as fast in the videos, and I'm always just like, man, it looks so much faster when I'm actually on it, um, but, uh, yeah, so that's mostly all I wanted to say, but basically this video is just going to be some clips and some pictures because it's basically just another one wheel, which, or another one wheel pint, which you guys have seen so much on my social media and YouTube. Uh, this one just goes a little faster and farther. Um, so yeah, so my original pint, um, goes, uh, about a max of, about a max of 10 to 12 miles, um, and it can go up to 60 miles an hour. Um, but this new one can go up to 20 miles, um, and it can go up to 18 miles an hour. Uh, so yeah, so, so far the fastest I've gotten on it is 16.1, and that's plenty fast enough for me, honestly. Um, I haven't even hit pushback yet. Pushback's usually probably at about 17 or so, um, because the pint I have hit pushback on, um, and the fastest I've went on that is 15.2, I believe. 15.2 or 15.3. Uh, so yeah, so that's pretty much all I wanted to say, so hopefully you guys are sticking around, because now we're going to actually get into the video, just some pictures and video clips and, like, a voiceover and whatnot. Um, but, uh, yeah, so that's pretty much it for, for this part. So that's all I really wanted to talk about, but yeah, welcome to the new Pine Tex. I officially now have two one wheels, um, which is awesome, and I'm, uh, my dad's tried it before, but he learned, he was actually, he used to not be able to balance on it at all, but today he was actually riding around the the yard, so he's kind of learning how to ride it, and that'd be cool if I could go ride one wheel, uh, with him, that'd be pretty awesome, uh, so yeah, so, but that's pretty much it, um, so yeah, so, uh, enjoy the rest of this video, um, and there will, of course, be plenty of content on my social media and YouTube with the new Pine Tex, uh, but, uh, yeah, so enjoy the rest of the video. Alright, so as you, uh, can probably see right now, usually I, like, edit the video and then watch it while recording the voiceover, so I know what I'm talking about, um, <laughs> but this time I'm just recording the voiceover and then I'm gonna edit the video, uh, but, uh, yeah, so hopefully it all kinda matches up here, um, but, uh, yeah, so, uh, this is gonna be pretty much pictures and video clips and whatnot, of course there'll be more content, uh, in the future, uh, but for now I just got a little clip of me, uh, kinda hitting that 16 miles an hour, um, and just riding around a little bit. Uh, that's not my very first ride. I got my very first ride on footage on the original Pint, if you remember that, uh, where I got a wobbly and it went flying down the road because I had no idea how to ride it. Uh, but yeah, of course, now I know how to ride it. So yeah. Um, all of a sudden, I would have not slapped that carbon fiber fender on right away because I do not want my carbon fiber fender scratched. Uh, so yeah, my my original fender, my gray fender for my Pint, um, that one's really scratched up because I slapped that on right when I got my original pint and then I sent it flying down the road. So yeah. Uh, but yes, I did get a carbon fiber fender for this one too, but the last one was my the uh, Cyberpunk, uh, the Craft and Ride Cyberpunk pint uh, carbon fiber fender. Um, this one is the actual one wheel pint branded one. Uh, so it's got that signature pint rounded shape. Uh, but uh, yeah. I would say overall, I do still like how my original pint looks a little better. I think it's just a little more even mix of that sign and gray and carbon fiber. And I also like how the, the fender looks a little bit more just because it's kind of, um, just because it's kind of like angled and whatnot. Uh, and, uh, yeah, it's just a little more sleek looking. Um, 
But that fender actually goes on top of the fender delete. Of course, the one wheel fenders, they actually are the fender built in with to the fender delete. So it's all one thing. Um, but yeah, I still like how the new one looks a lot. And as you can see, I did go with my same theme of my uh, my favorite like sign and gunmetal gray with the carbon fiber. That's like kind of my signature look, I think. Um, but uh, yeah, um, kind of matches my logo, of course. But uh, yeah, so I mean, that's that, that's pretty much it. I mean, it, it's so fun, and yeah, you'll see a lot more of it in the future, as I've said, uh, but I, yeah, I mean, there's not much to it, uh, because you guys have seen all that, but this is basically just a pint that looks a little different, um, that also goes a little bit faster and a little bit further, so yeah, yeah, now I can go on 20 mile rides, which Great Falls, Montana, uh, those like 10 to 11 mile rides were, I could get pretty much across town, so 20 mile rides, like, that's that's gonna be some big rides there uh so yeah so I, I don't really know what else to say um of course this one i guess i can say uh this one i can still use my pint uh ultra charger with um it takes a little longer to charge uh i don't know if it's like exactly double the length of time uh but it definitely seems like it uh but it doesn't really matter because it might take double the time to charge it but you also get like double the range so uh, yeah but that's pretty much it. So, uh, yeah, I know I said I wasn't going to get one, but I did. So that's pretty much it for the video. So make sure to like, subscribe, and uh, yeah, I'll see you later. Bye.